All right, hi, hi everyone. Frankie here, New West Reset. Welcome back and thank you once again for shooting in, joining a fella here for another boots on the ground video. We're looking at this old thing today. So I'm gonna run across the street and uh, see if I can get a closer look. I am on the corner of 29th Avenue and 14th Street Southwest today in Bankview, just up the road from where I live. And uh, this place was really run down and I thought they were gonna tear the, the poor thing down, but nope, they fixed it up. It's got a hair salon in there and a uh, flower shop or something. So yeah, let's have a closer look. Stick around, be right back. Alright, so uh, textured brick that I can see here, and it's been painted, unfortunately, but at least they chose a color that's reminiscent of the original brick color. And uh, this pavement here kind of slopes upward toward the building a bit, so it makes a guy wonder how far down that brick goes. Multi levels here to the sidewalk, so they've had to slope it up and build it up for whatever reason. I'm thinking this this goes up quite a bit deeper down it's uh, really interesting it's got the entrance there in the corner it's kind of a stumpy looking little door even though it has what looks like or used to be a transom window above it but that door looks like it should be a foot taller doesn't it i don't know even the silver hang portion of the roof here looks really low and i would imagine that was added on i don't think that was originally part of the building looks odd and it looks to me like they've boarded in another door here and just put some vents in it but then they left this door let's whip around to the side by the alley here down the back lane oh, see uh, they've covered this side in schmutz it's so really hard to tell what's going on here I'm gonna get some glare from the Sun sorry about that Got some of the old light fixtures up there, probably 1940s-ish. It's so tough to tell, you know, when they cover it with all that textured crud. Let's see if we can peek in the side here. See if we can see anything. And now they've just built in a little addition. It's probably the cooler for the the, the flower shop where they, you know, it's like a refrigerated area where they keep the flowers. But yeah, kind of an interesting, funny little building. It looks like it's uh, been altered and renovated a couple of times. But you still got some of the old tech there. Not old world tech, but just again, in terms of maybe knob and tube wiring from, you know, the 30s really neat so this funny looking little place right next door to it's kind of odd too with that window that I don't know looks to me like that's shooting down in the ground a bit but this thing is so heavily covered in textured uh, crap and every single window is all boarded up that it's hard to tell what's going on with this place this is the back alley but it, it looks like it's the main entrance so that's odd you know what, I'm going to whip around in the front of this thing too and see what's going on. Hang tough, be back in a sec. Alright, so I've just come up around to the front of this thing. Uh, it's a different business in the front. Stinton Financial Group on the front and uh, Furniture Restor Antique Restoration at the back, I guess. I don't know. It's never seen that before. It's very unusual. Not the most interesting building. It's definitely an older building that's been given multiple facelifts and they've tried to gussy it up with some pillars and stuff but I mean it's uh, I don't know if I was hazard to guess maybe uh, 1920s 1930s at, at the latest but probably more like the 40s not as old as uh, this little place here on the corner the hair salon and the flower shop either way kind of interesting very unique looking 
So yeah, there you go. That's it. I think that's going to seal the deal here for today. Another short but sweet one here. Frankie, New West Reset. As per usual, let me know what you think down below there. And uh, of course, do all the other things. And until the next one, take care out there and have yourselves a good one. All right? Cheers.